Guys, this is a delicious sweet onion tomato sauce. If you've never made pasta before, this is the one that you should make. If you have made pasta before, I've got a tip for you that's gonna make all of your other pastas way better. Let's do it. We're gonna make a sweet penne tomato sauce. Now, the secret ingredient is not an onion, but it is important that we have very, very thin onions so it can melt into the dish. Try and get really thin pieces. Full blast heat. Okay, olive oil of the extra virgin variety. There we go. Okay, a little salt. The number one thing that you guys are getting wrong is the water content. That is the secret ingredient. You can see we're getting a little bit of color on the onion here. It's starting to burn, it's starting to caramelize. What do we do? We take some water. And what that does is it lowers the temperature of the onion to the temperature the water boils at, preventing burning. Don't be afraid about putting too much water because it's always gonna cook off. And as the water cooks down, it will start to burn again and, and just be proficient with the water here. Salty pasta water, everybody knows the shtick, right? This is a full pound, we're gonna use half a pound. We're cooking for two people. Boom, we have black pepper, we have red pepper. All the Italian grandmas have come together and agreed. You're only allowed to use one or the other. You cannot use both. They will come, they will find you. Havoc will be wreaked. So, I say red pepper. See how they're starting to turn colors? Really nice. Really good onion base here, and this is so much better than putting sugar into your tomato sauce. This, this is natural, natural sugars. And onions are sweet. Okay, this is half a can of tomatoes. Here's the pro move. Pasta is two minutes under what the box says to do. And we're gonna put it in the sauce. That's what we're gonna do. It's gonna finish in here. All right, the next point I wanna make is about cheese. Everybody's got a different cheese grater. The internet says, Frankie, you've got to use cup measurements. And it doesn't work all the time. So what we're gonna do is do three ounces of cheese. It's gonna look like a lot on a microplane. That's why it's so good to do it by weight. Okay, that is one quarter of one ounce. Okay, here's an ounce and a half. Here we go. Cheese is going in, we're gonna sprinkle it right on top, all of it. We're gonna turn off our heat. We're gonna add a little more water, help it melt, and we're gonna stir. Look at that, this is beautiful. Nice sheen on the pasta. Maybe a tiny bit too sweet. What can we do to counter the sweetness? Lemon. Which I just happen to carry in my pocket at all times. Now look, if it looks a little thick again, this is looking, it's looking thick. What's happening? Water's coming off. How do we solve this problem before we post a picture to the net of inters? Add a little more water, get it in there. Gorgeous, sweet, and easy tomato sauce. Cheesy, lemony, sweet onion. So you can kiss it with a little more cheese on top if you want. You do not have to do this. And now you can come in with some parsley or basil. I think the move is to just go whole leaves, like that. And now a little olive oil at the end is also a wonderful thing. So, there you have a sweet onion and lemon penne sauce whose secret ingredient is the most pedestrian and underwhelming of all the ingredients, water. So, there you go. Easy dish, pro tip, rock and roll.